just like this one. This one's a fake egg. You guys can't break it, so you can feel it. It's the same weight and everything. You guys can go ahead and take a look at that. Pass it around. Caribbean flamingos get their color, that pink color, from what they eat. In the wild, they typically eat algae. They'll eat brine shrimp, other little crustaceans, little tiny guys. The way they eat is almost the same way they pick up the mud. They turn their head upside down, which is why their beak is crooked like that. They turn their head upside down, as you can see some of them are doing. Then they have a piston-like tongue, which means it goes back and forth or up and down. And on their tongue, it looks like a comb, like you would comb your hair with. And the food gets caught in the comb, and as they move it up and down, the water comes back out their beak, and the food goes down their throat. Wow. These guys typically live around 50 years of age in the wild. The oldest known flamingo in the wild was 59. The oldest known flamingo in a zoo was 51. These guys like to be in big flocks of birds. They have safety in numbers. You guys can look at them and you see they don't have a lot of defenses. They can fly and they can bite, but their beak is not sharp. They don't have teeth. So the best way to be protected is to have a buddy on either side of you. These guys will have the mirror in the back so that they think there are twice as many birds as there are. It's not because they like to look at themselves. We have three birds that are younger than the rest of them. We have two two-year-olds and one one-year-old. They're a little bit lighter in color. You guys can probably pick them out. Although most of our birds are molting right now, and molting is the process of losing their old feathers and getting new feathers. And during that process,